Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Arcanum. I figure that since I'm back here in uh, Tarant, I'll head back down into the sewers, see what uh, new things we can face. Uh, I had missed a treasure chest all the way down in uh, P. Skyler's place, so I went ahead and uh, head headed down in there and got that. Um, might be able to take these guys on. Let's see. Level 26. Yeah, we might be able to do something against them. Uh, I also... <clears throat> uh, so, Magnus has the balance sword in his inventory, but he's using the featherweight axe. So that seems a little bit better for him right now. Um, I got a lot of extra light fatigue potions. So... One thing about the uh, the dread armor is that people don't really like you much when you're wearing it. Uh, so I decided I'm going to keep it for now, but I'm not sure whether I will, like, actually keep it, keep it. Also, um, sort of sickness shopped, uh, popped up in the, the gypsies shop, uh, and it looked pretty good, so I decided to purchase that. Uh, should do some extra poison damage. Does good damage in general. It has reduced uh, Chuka's strength a little bit, but, you know, whatever. So, overall, um, also, I am now using a Helm of Light and a, a Shield of Force. So, we're, we got some extra defense there. Let's see how this goes. Let's see. Make our way over. Uh, back through all this that we've been. Let's see. I have... Not been up here. Let's go ahead and do that. These things will be easy. I'm not hitting all that often, but... Dog can take care of it. Good dog. Who's a good dog? Who's a good dog? Hello. Alright, you know what? Let's just do that. That does not look like the shield I'm wearing. <laughs> Sog. Thank you for, uh, for reminding me. Um, also, so, I wasn't getting any uh, boost out of the, uh, um, uh, eye gear, so I've gone ahead and put them on Virgil for now. Uh, I should get Virgil a, uh, Helm of Light as well, but that can wait. Oh god. Holy cow! I don't like what just happened there. That, that is that is a lot of noise. Okay, one dead. some armor damage, too. I don't like that. Well, that's good. 
Uh, let's move a little bit further away. How we, uh, how we doing? Alright, your armor was damaged. Your armor was damaged. Your armor was damaged. Yours was da well, that may have already been damaged, actually. Okay, nothing on them. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna bolt of lightning. Oh, no, no, I'm not. Now I'm gonna run down here. And use a fatigue potion. That's fine, you can come up and attack me. Oh, I think he poisoned it. Nice. So that's the uh, the new sword. Of course, we, uh, we kill him pretty quick. Alright, any goodies in here? A flower. Yay. Some rags. Don't care about the rags. Uh, an unidentified dagger. Uh, 739 gold. And some other things. That's pretty nice. Nothing there. And an emerald. So, I, one thing that I, I kind of came up in the, the comments about uh, empty chests, one of the reasons why it annoys me, and same thing with empty barrels, is because not all of these are clickable. So, you know, you'll, you'll get into a, a room and there's like a dozen you know, barrels like this. You can't click on that. That they're, they're not actual containers. They're just scenery. And then there's, you know, one or two that, that you can. And if they're empty, that means that, that the designers of the game specifically put it in there that you could click on these and open them and then didn't populate them with anything. And that does annoy me. You know, either... Uh, you know, and it, it didn't bother me in... Ultima 7 that you couldn't, that you didn't get stuff out of all the treasure chests and all the barrels and all the crates because you could open up all of them. But in these games, you can't open up all of them. And so I feel like if you're gonna make that distinction between these you can't open, clearly there's nothing of interest in them, but these you can, then there should always be something of interest inside of them. Even if it's just a little rusty dagger or something like that. Where does this take me? Into a place full of traps. Well, let's go ahead and quick save. Any, uh, anything? Nope. That's locked. Alright, you know what? For now, let's just not worry about that. I don't want to piss people off by uh, opening up, unlocking doors that I shouldn't be or something. Ah. Let's murder you a little bit. Like that. 44 damage. It is nice to have some uh, ogres along to just murder the things that... Ah, a slime demon. That seems like fun, right? Right?
Okay, uh, what do we got? Uh, lots of slime demons and sewer shamblers. Let's not go that way just yet. I think that uh, this way... All right, no, I am a little bit turned around. I was expecting to get to the bandits, but I think I uh, went the wrong way. Oh, well, it's fine. Hope I'm not missing things on the ground. Goody, a putrid rodent. I hey, got a critical hit. Eat the rodent, dog meat. Eat the rodent. Or, you know, you could just uh, kill it with 44 damage and 33 fatigue damage. That's. It's just mean. Oh. Interesting. Am I stuck? Um... I... I have found the Daggerfall Void! I'm... I'm in the walls. How do I get out? I don't have any of the teleport spells. Hmm. Well, I guess we're loading back up because, um... Yeah, that, uh... That didn't go so well. I somehow... Glitched myself into the void. Cannot see the target. What? All right, whatever. It's fine with me. Let's see if we can avoid glitching ourselves into the void again. Avoid the void? Yes. Yes. I have no idea how that happened, but... Oh well. Hello! You know what? Do that. I should have done. I went. Should have gone for a lightning bolt. But now, now I'm poisoned. Virgil, thank you. Thank you, Virgil. Uh, Muckwalker. Let's go with a bolt of lightning just because it's fun. And I'll be asleep. Just, uh, don't mind me, guys. Just gonna take a nap here. Oh, yeah, I feel, I feel dirty. I feel a little dirty. Uh, let's see. Some wine. Saltpeter, stearic acid. Not all that interesting, but whatever. Actually, I'll take that back. Um, Virgil, you hold on to these. 
There we go. Should probably use some of my other potions, too. At least we're not uh, back in the void. That's that was a good thing. All right, what do we got? A slither guard. going to come. Go dog meat. Just, just ignore this one. Whoops. That's not good. Probably pay more attention. Thank you. Paying attention to things. That's silly. should probably use some of these now, shouldn't I? That would be wise, wouldn't it? See, look, you can't click on these two. Unidentified large armor. Interesting. 1,000 coins. That's nice. I'll have to get that identified in a bit. I don't think there's anything on the sewer slitherers. Okay, what do we got? Uh, you guys... Heck of a lot up here. There's still a lot left to, to these sewers. They're pretty big. Let's go down this way first. Yeah, run away. Fine with me. Ooh, a critical hit. And I took a critical. Critical miss. Oh well. Not that, uh, anything uh, down here? Just, you know, having a nice little sewer adventure. Nothing down here in the corner. Don't see anything. Take a quick save. Hello. Come at me. Yeah, run away. Haha. <laughs> Exactly sure why you guys are going around there, but whatever. <laughs> well, you know, I was gonna uh, jolt them, but uh, guess I won't. Hey, all right, another level. Unidentified sword, unidentified dagger. Interesting. Is that uh, puts me at moderate? All right. Um, virtual, you're not gonna use. You, no, you're gonna use that. You're gonna use that. All right. You're not gonna use that. Good. Oh, hi. Go 
go dog meat. Who's a good puppy? Who's a good puppy? Alright, well, I got another level. Um, my perception is down. That's because of my helmet, isn't it? Yeah, perception minus one. Well, I guess I'll be okay. Let's get some more intelligence. Um, and... Let's see, I've got max followers of four. Kind of like to up my uh, charisma a bit more, too. Yeah, I'll do that a little bit. Eventually, we might be able to get another follower. I like having lots of party members. Especially when they can do all of the work for me. Alright, we got some ghouls. These guys are easy. some of this too? No, not Chuka. No, not Chuka. Fine, whatever. You guys take care of him. Thank you. Do not see anything in here either. Got more ghouls. This is what Jolt is made for, of course. Oh, alright. Ow, ow, ow. Critical hit and it just dies. Wait, uh, did I? No, I do have my weapon. Looked like I was punching for a second there. Thank you. <laughs> I love it that they can kill them even before they get to me and trigger the, the combat. That's ah, so good. Hello? Ooh, critical hit. Nice. 12 damage. Stab. Crush. Murder. Alright, where is the sewer slitherer? Oh, whatever. You guys can take care of it. This isn't dangerous, right? Dogme is just tearing through them. So good. Should probably use some more fatigue potions. I'll use... Yeah, just use these. There we go. Alright, any... Any chests or anything in here? Barrels? Nope. This goes up somewhere.
I do believe we're in the boil. Got orc Berserkers. Level 30. Let's save it. How are we going to get our faces mauled off? You do not belong here, Elf. There. Well, you're not uh, getting pissed off at me, like, and attacking me directly. What could an elf possibly want with me? Well, first he wants to check to see if there's anything in your goodies. There's some Ginkka root out there. Hi, Brute Fang. Oh, that's actually uh, not great. Um, there we go. Someone kill it! Oh, it looks like the... Uh, oh my. Looks like I have pissed off the uh, all the orcs, too. Seriously hurt, madam. Well, please help me. There goes Virgil. Okay, uh, well, that was not great. Gnome Guard, Orc Berserkers. They, uh, apparently did not like me going into, uh, there. Half-orc guard. But yeah, this is the boil. Um, I think for now, we will head back down here. Uh, I think I'd rather go investigate that from the proper direction. And also, a whole bunch of uh, level 30 orc guards may not be the best thing to face. Maybe a little bit too early for them. But we'll take care of uh take care of them eventually. Come on guys. Let's get down here. We'll see what's uh, up here. Yeah, I'll get back into this room, and then when we come back next time, we can head uh, north from here. Okay, but that will be uh, next time. For now, I will uh, call it an episode. I'll see you next time, everyone.